Hey everyone, Dark Era here, back with a brand new video. It's that time. The video that I think more than half of you have been waiting for. Who are Starfire's parents? Now before we get into it, make sure you like this video and hit that subscribe button because I have some more videos coming very soon. Now before we get started, someone commented on a thumbnail that I posted yesterday. Z- Z- Uh, I'ma call you Z Dog. What up Z Dog? Alright, so Z Dog says, What do they actually look like? Why don't you show their faces? Really, that dumb. Just show the face already. I'm going to see their faces. This is actually a really good point. Why would you hide the faces if I'm gonna show the face during the video? There is a reason why I wanted to keep this part a surprise. You see, the thumbnail actually has a secret to it. If you look, this isn't Starfire. The dad is looking at this person right here while the mom is looking at Starfire. Now, who is this person? Well, Team Arrow, that is Wildfire, Starfire's little brother. And the story of Starfire's parents actually center around Wildfire. Let's get to the beginning. A few years before Starfire joined the Teen Titans, on her home planet, there was an invasion. And I'm sure you guys know that Starfire was actually the princess of this planet because her parents were the king and queen and they had three children. There was Blackfire, the oldest, Starfire, the middle child, and Wildfire, the son. Now, even though Wildfire was the youngest, because he was a boy, he would be the new king after her parents died. So he was very important for the kingdom. Now, when the invasion started, the parents were very concerned about the future of their family lineage. So they read Superman comics and they got the idea to send Wildfire away to protect him. And they vowed to keep Wildfire a secret. Now, you know Blackfire, she don't like anybody in her family. So on top of the parents losing their only son, Blackfire sold Starfire into slavery to the aliens that were invading. Now that the parents have lost two of their kids and their two favorite because, I mean, Blackfire, come on. They were so heartbroken that they actually died. No joke, they actually died. Now what about Starfire? Well, she was saved by this dude who became sort of like her adopted father. And then a few years later, Starfire arrived on Earth and joined the Teen Titans. I know this is a crazy story, and unfortunately because of their tragic backstory, there isn't really much other information about Starfire's parents, but I wanted to give you the information that I could find. That way you knew what they look like, what happened to them, where are they now, and a little bit more history on Starfire that you may not have known about. Alright guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a like, please subscribe, and leave a comment below what was your favorite thing that you learned in this video. Also, make sure to subscribe because I have plenty of more videos coming soon. The next one is going to be about Robin's parents. And after that, I want you guys to choose what should be next. Now, I could make a video about why Blackfire hates Starfire because there is a reason. I could tell you about the time where I actually met the voices of Beast Boy and Robin. There's even a video on YouTube where it shows me in the background meeting them. Or I could talk about the lost episode of Teen Titans. Leave a comment below of which video you would want to see next. And leave a comment if you have ideas for videos. Like I said, make sure to subscribe and watch out for the contest video coming soon where I'll be giving away a certain prize, either a $100 Amazon gift card, $100 gift card, or signed merchandise from either Teen Titans, Pokemon, whatever you want. Now, when I say signed, I mean signed from the voice actors themselves. And also one piece that, that would be signed by me, but obviously the real prize will be getting it signed by the voice actor that you want. Anyways, thanks for watching the video. I'll see you next time.